your key issues for this week. Absolute Carnage number one. It's a highly anticipated series that I said was coming out last week, but it's actually coming out this week. So I do apologize. Immortal Hulk number 22. This is the first appearance of Metatron. Buffy the Vampire Slayer number seven. The first appearance of Dark Willow. Kiss End number four. This isn't really a key issue, but it's a book that's based off my favorite band and, you know, I gotta give them some, some love, some comic book love. We've got The End and Blood and Stardust in the store, so pick them up. Major X number zero. This is gonna be the first appearance of X Command, and it'll have a whole bunch of cool Wolverine and Deadpool stuff. Die number six. This book has sold out ahead of its release. We only have three issues coming to the store, so we're not gonna do holds on these, so make sure you get here early. Dark Age number one. Since its debut at this year's free comic book day, everybody has fallen in love with this book. They want to get their bits on it. We only have three coming into the store and it's already sold out of the distributors. So no holds on these either. Um, other killer books coming out. Agents of, Agents of Atlas number one. Berserker Unbound number one. Coffin Bound number one. Deceased number four. Green Lantern number 10. And House of X number two. These are your key issues this week and we'll see you in the store soon. Hey guys, welcome on back to The Adventure Begins. As always, I'm Jarek, and today we're going to have another game we'll be unboxing for you, and today it's going to be the game Tukey. It's one we recently got in store. It's a puzzle block stacking kind of game. It's kind of really cool. Definitely come on in and try it out. So inside the box, we're going to have, first things first, our instruction booklet. Usually the first thing always on top. It's really nice. It's really easy to read. Very easy setup for it. Tells you exactly what each step does and how to go about doing it. Cannot complain in terms of that. Always really nice to have an easy to read, easy to understand instruction manual for new games. Uh, inside the box, we're going to get our whole play kit here, which is everything we need for the game. First things first, we're going to get what looks like our, uh, our base for all of our cards, for that way we know what we're doing. So it's going to go right kind of right there for now. Second up, we're going to have our cards. This is going to tell us what we're trying to stack and how we're supposed to do it. Uh, we're gonna get just a whole handful of cards. Uh, there's two different teams. It looks like orange as well as purple. It's a way to kind of make it a little more competitive if you really wanted to. Um, they're really nicely easy to understand. Cool colors. Really quite, um, you know, easy to pick up and go with. These are gonna kind of just go pop right into the game here, and that's kind of how you know. Hey, I'm building this. I gotta do something like that. It's really nice. All the other cards kind of stick right inside, right there. Up next, we have the colored blocks that we're supposed to be stacking with. Uh, the game refers to these as the stones that we're using to build. Um, you're going to get uh, three uh, one by five blocks of four different colors. Uh, purple, blue, yellow, and black. Um, pretty easy to understand. Kind of moves forward. They're all just that straight kind of block like that. Nice and heavy, so you kind of there's a nice weight to them, so you have to worry about knocking things over as you uh, keep playing the game and keep building up. Uh, up next, we're going to have just a single die. This is going to kind of help us figure out um, what we're supposed to be building. If you notice, the cards have three different uh, animals on them. Looks like there's fish, bears, and birds. Uh, depending on what you roll, you kind of orient the card to be like that. And now you know I have to stack up to be that. It's really cool, really nice. And the last couple things in here are um, angled blocks. They're also uh, five squares long, essentially, but they're different shapes and sizes that you can move around to get uh, to try and build up as you need to. You can see these are just like a couple of them as we go. There's like smaller L's and then there's this miscellaneous like T blocks such as this. So yeah, this is essentially the basics of what is inside Tuki. There's so much you can do, there's a lot you can build. As far as you know gameplay goes, the is Use your imagination to get to the top of what you need to do, and this game is going to be perfect for you. Once again, it's a cooperative game, uh, pretty easy to take up and understand. Uh, and you can try games like this and many more here at The Adventure Begins. Hey guys, I'm back with some more mangoes or manga, but um, so I got two Disney classics turned into manga. So, I mean, if you're a Disney fan, come on down, try some manga out. Uh, first, we got Pirates of the Caribbean. Um, basically, you follow um, uh, Will Turner and Elizabeth Swan in the search for Davy Jones Locker and Jack Sparrow. See if they can find it and see kind of what happens. 
But um, then we also got The Nightmare Before Christmas with Jack Skellington and all your favorite sort of spooky, scary people. But um, yeah, really good book. I, I would definitely recommend it. So come on down, try some manga out. All right, man, that's it for episode 22 of The Adventure Begins, man. We'd like to thank everybody who came out for the two-day snap sale. Yeah, it was a really cool event. A lot of people in the store and, you know, got a lot of stuff moved. That's right, man. Yeah, yeah. So remember, kids. With the penguin's umbrella. <laughs> oh, man, you snapped me, didn't you? Yeah, sorry, man. I hate you. Eh. That's it, man. I'm Jazz. And I'm Jarek. See you, nerds. Since its debut this year, good lord. Wow. With the penguins brother. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Perfect timing, too. <laughs>